Rob Zombie is among the busiest artists in rock and roll, and he's already eyeing his next movie. The Broad Street bullies the story of the 70s-era Philadelphia Flyers who fed off of their pugnacious reputation. It's his next subject to tackle for the silver screen. We asked Rob how the whole idea came about. Well, the Flyers, the Broad Street Bullies movie, uh, came about several years ago. Someone approached me who had acquired the rights from the Flyers for their story, and he was a fan of my movies. He didn't know if I was a hockey fan or knew anything about it. He just thought my sensibilities at how I made those films would fit a period film about the Flyers. And But I wasn't ready to do it at that time, so it kind of sat around. But it, you know, about a year or so ago, I called him up. I was like, let's do this. So where is he at with the film? As of right now, the script is done, because that was a long process, putting the script together. And uh, we're just sort of putting the financing together, putting the structure of the film together, all the boring stuff, and also beginning the, the early process of casting, trying to figure out who's going to play who and what's going to happen, which is tricky because, uh, you know, a lot of actors can't skate that good. Any actors lined up? Well, my theory is that actually nobody's going to be able to learn to play to the level we're going to need them to play at to sh make the scenes believable. Like, and you can easily fake being able to play baseball or football, but hockey, um, those guys are such superior athletes that I think we're going to need to find actors who are already good skaters or players who are good actors. Zombie's last film, Lords of Salem, was critically acclaimed. However, it didn't have the cash for a wide rollout. Fans everywhere will be able to watch it in the comfort of their own homes as the DVD and digital home release is set for September.